Hey guys, Basha again. Today, I'm um, again at the jetty. Haven't been here for a while. This is my setup. Uh, half ounce of jig and with this uh, swimming bed. And uh, I'm targeting for rockfish and link cod today. So, swimming bait, 15 pounds of line, half ounce weight, and the main line is 40 pounds. Let's cast it out and try our luck today. Fish on, fish on, fish on, fish on. Ah, don't know what kind of fish it is. But it fits like pretty good size. Ah, 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 nice. Ah, ah, well. See, this uh, first rockfish I get with this uh, swimming bait. Ah, it's, uh, first one for today, pretty good. And actually, I uh, uh, haven't been here for a while. Uh, first rockfish for last few months. Good. I'm moving. I'm moving to my fishing spot right now. It's uh, super slippery. And you have to be super careful when you guys are here. Like, be, make sure you guys are super careful. If you fall off and here, your leg will be screwed. Yeah. So, this is my fishing spot. I get my last fish here. Let's try to cast and see whether we can get more. Do it. Just uh, cast it far out and uh, rowing slowly. And uh, oh, whoa, oh, 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 another one, stay strong. Oh, oh, shit, we are here. Oh. Ah. Another big one. This is uh, was pretty fast, so you guys can see. I just get here, make my first cast, get one. Yeah. Yeah. This like a uh, swimming jig with a red tail is deadly. This is deadly for them. They cannot refuse this kind of jig. Good. Get them. I move back. Yeah, move back also is dangerous. You need to be super careful too. After I get my second fish, I come back here again. Why? Because rockfish, they swim in a school, right? Usually when you find one, you find a school. Just try to cast to the same spot and just repeat your technique. And uh, if they are still here, they will bite. Just like uh, rowing slowly and the tip your uh, fishing pole a little bit. Yeah, there are a lot of promise to bite every time. But if you, they are here, you just keep uh, doing what you did when you get your last fish. Yeah, and uh, when you are very close to the rocks, you want to row in quickly. So that you don't uh, get a snaggy over there. So one more cast. Uh, so just get this giant one. Wow, look at how big it is. Almost a three pound. Yeah, really good size. Go pack it up here, bro. Hey guys. 
Hey guys, I'm back home now. It's time for cooking. If you remember, I did a video about uh, black rock fish last time. It's a super simple. It's a steam one. Today, I'm going to show you guys a little bit of complex recipe, which is uh, a little bit complex, lots of complex. Let me show you guys. First, we want to uh, put some soy sauce. Uh, this one is like a 2.8 pounds. So I want to put like a two spoon of soy sauce. This is a salty soy sauce, two spoon. And this is a cooking wine. This is a cooking wine. Let's put another two spoon over there. One, two. Okay, this is a cooking wine. And then this is a ginger. Put the ginger over there. And black pepper. Yeah. And this is a green onion. Just uh, put some, make sure, like the soy sauce and the cooking wine is uh, cover the fish. And the, if you guys uh, see clearly, I have cut the meat off, the fish meat off, so that uh, we can put more of the sauce more into the fish body. So, just like this, just like this. Okay, so let the fish sit here for an, um, for about uh, like uh, 30 minutes. Then we will continue our process. So 30 minutes has passed. The fish is fully uh, black rock bass have been fully seasoned. Now we are ready to fry it. Um, this is oil. Um, just uh, let the oil temperature high. Like when you see the smoke come out from the oil, that means it's ready to fry. Um, when it's ready, we'll put the fish in. Each side are like fried about like two to three minutes. Just let it dry the skin and so that it will be crispy at each side and we will be ready to fry. So now let's put the fish in and fry it. Be careful. Um, when you fry the fish. Yeah, just put it in and put the uh, low down a little bit of the gas level and let it uh, fry it as crispy at uh, each side. Okay, so I have fried the fish for about uh, six minutes. At this point, the fish should be uh, ready let's put the fish uh, into our cooking pot and then worry about the sauce so this is my cooking pot um this is mushroom raw i'll put the already fried fish uh, on top of it and then pour the sauce um, on top of the fish and at here you can see that's our that were uh, born some fire and uh, cook it while we are eating so Let's now put the fish on top of the mushroom and cook the sauce. Okay guys, uh, this is oil, we just fried the fish, right? So we will use the oil to cook the um, sauce, but before that, we don't need this much so uh, oil. Yeah, just uh, leave a little bit of oil inside. Um, now, we need to uh, first put some garlic inside it and then this is a spicy uh, soy bean sauce let's put a two spoon because that fish is about a two almost three pounds so we're, you will need a bit more sauce and since i like spicy i will put some uh, sour uh, chili pepper sauce if you don't like it you don't need it but uh, i like the spicy stuff so i'll put uh, two spoon of this sauce here and let's open the fire 
to cook this for about like a, a few minutes. Yeah, the salt should be enough right now. Now let's put some like a, this is a, a vinegar, put a bit, a bit of vinegar. And this is the sugar. Let's just put a two spoon of sugar inside. And uh, this is a black soy sauce, just uh, for the color. Now let's cook it. Okay, now it's the time for the cooking wine. But remember, that's all oil, right? So when you put the uh, like a cooking wine, like uh, be careful because the oil will spill out. And then we need like uh, one bowl of water, boil the water at here, and let it uh, cook it for about like three minutes. Let me put the water inside. So this is a uh, hot water. Okay, so the fish, uh, the sauce for the fish has been ready. Um, but I haven't caught in the videos. I put some seaweed into the soup. Um, let's turn off the uh, gas. And then, let's move it. This is uh, a fish, we have a pretty fried. Let's just pour the sauce on top of the fish. Yep. So, and if you guys like cilantro, I like cilantro. I just put the cilantro on top of the fish. This is Hey guys, I have uh, started a fire under the cooking pot and uh, here is a black rockfish I had just cooked. Um, it smells really good. I'm ready to have my dinner now. Thanks, thanks you guys for watching. See you next time. It smells so good.